guys so this is the wig that we'll be working with today it is a four by four closure 24 inches from Ayiyi hair company i did go ahead and bleach the knots and they came out what amazing like amazing came out chef's kiss fire i do believe that this hair is 180 density if it's not 180 density then it's 200 density but regardless their hair is very thick which i love because if you know me you know i like me some thick hair so the hair did come in this box my box is a little beat up i don't know what fedex was doing but inside the box you know the hair comes in this plastic bag which i had to take out because i had to bleach the knots they do give you this little bag kit inside comes some lashes and i have worked with ayi here before and i can say this they don't send you cheap weak lashes like their lashes are actually pretty good and pretty cute also in this they sent me a edge brush wig caps wow and they sent the good color too and i got this cute pin what look at look at this it's like a hairpin it looked mad cheap on camera, but in person, it don't look this cheap. Like, it's really cute. It's a nice little scissor with the little diamonds. That's cute or whatever. Thank you. So, now let's get to installation. And now I'm at the point in my life where I am tired of frontals. Like, they are too much work. The glue, like, the lifting, the getting the edges, the baby hair, it's just too much for me now. So, the closures, baby, we are back back at it okay back to it you don't have to do much there ain't no cost customization that you really got to do except for bleaching your knots and if you don't want to do that you ain't even got to do that and also by the way it did come with the elastic band i did not put this on there it came with that which i love so we're gonna go ahead and put this on and it fits like a glove i do believe that this is a um swiss lace but again like i already bleached the knots so i'm not really pressed about the whole you know lace knot matching when you're doing the baby hairs or whatever because when i'm telling you this is about to be kept real simple real simple so right now what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna go ahead and hot comb the closure down and i'm going to be using my edge booster wax stick we're gonna do a little center part when hot combing your hair you want to make sure to do it section by section so that's what we gonna do to make sure this thing is flat flat okay i am using this hot comb by andy's and it is from amazon so if you would like to purchase it it will be linked down below <laughs> Circles in my bedroom. I've been chasing secrets in your heirloom. Let me do what I do. Press slow down. Let me talk to you. Don't tell me about your worries. I ain't staying till the afternoon. I like you in proximity, but now they're so far from the truth. I loved you from a distance. So I'm gonna go ahead and just cut the lace off. I'm gonna use a razor comb and I'm gonna go in like a zigzag type of motion. Y'all already know how that go. If y'all don't, let me just tell y'all. Let me let me try to show y'all. Basically, I like to use the razor comb because it gives it a kind of rugged cut anyway, as opposed to a straight across cut. So we're going to cut this off all across. And ta-da. Look at that. This is a really let me this is also why I love closures because the installation process is easy peasy lemon squeezy literally one two three and this is what it looks like up close this is not HD lace this is not no perfect lace no transparent lace it's just a regular lace and I didn't put no type of products it's completely glueless like completely glued us so now i'm just gonna go ahead and flat iron the hair by the way this 24 inches is pretty long for 24 inches but i'm not complaining at all so i'm gonna flat iron it and then i'm gonna come back with my initial review but who do i call if it ain't you tell me who to call if it ain't you i've been pacing circles in my bedroom i've been tracing 
goods in your heirloom Who do I call if it ain't you? Tell me who to call if it ain't you I've been facing circles in my bedroom I've been tracing secrets in your heirloom Calculating all the aftermath Now when nemesis a menace in my mind But protagonists in all my drink A ceiling on my doubts I need healing in this drought I've been singing to the sea Alright you guys So y'all know I have to get a little cute or whatever Look a little you know a little something something for the camera so this is what we looking like i did go ahead and add like the little baby hairs in the corner i really didn't need to but i only did it just so y'all can see how versatile it is in a sense well how you can still make it look like a frontal without it being a frontal you know so that's why i added that in the little corners so let's get into the my initial review of the hair so like i said the hair is 24 inches first things first i will say it is more than true to length i am about five six and let me show y'all where it stand on me like it it touches it touches my waist i bring it to the front and this is where it sits on me so i would definitely say it is very true to length if not more than true to length again this is a four by four closure and it's doing the damn thing okay i didn't put anything on the lace the knots do bleach well however i'm not sure if it's because i use sturdy developer but typically on other laces i just sit the bleach on it for about 10 minutes but with this lace i probably sat it on it for like 20 25 minutes like i actually forgot it on there it didn't damage the lace or anything but initially when i put it on i checked in like 10 minutes and it didn't lift at all so if you're gonna bleach your knots you definitely have to leave the bleach on for a little longer than usual with other laces it may also be because this is not like a hd lace which is like a thinner lace i'm not sure but it did take quite some time for the knots to lift the hair is very thick nice and thick free flowy um when i first opened it out the package it didn't really shed like just now running my fingers through i only got one strand and i don't even think this is a strand from this oh yeah only got one little strand but every hair sheds so don't let nobody tell you oh the hair doesn't shed at all because it's a lie every hair sheds okay everything sheds i really love the fact that they included an elastic band on the wig without me having to add my own elastic band because it definitely does add some security to it the hair is luscious it flows so freely i like it i definitely like it the ends are not split you don't have split ends you see it actually kind of like curve on its own pretty good so overall i definitely do like this hair this is about to be my everyday wig i need a closure that i can put on my head not have to glue it and take it off at night and throw it right back on in the morning and just go okay so this is definitely what this wig is going to be hitting for she's about to be my everyday wig my all-purpose wig that's what she's going to be okay again i have received hair from ayee before so i do know that their quality is good and their hair when it's thick like it stays thick it doesn't shed so i'm not even concerned about it shedding and becoming thinner because once it's thick like it stays thick i love the density of their wig they have really thick wigs and the construction of the wig is really really good there's no loose ends nothing sticking up nice and flat as y'all can see nice and flat so that's kind of pretty much it for everything like all the specs about the hair i like the hair it didn't have like a weird scent it had the regular hair smell that you get like it didn't smell like like pneumonia or anything but it didn't smell like roses and daisies but that's pretty much it i hope you guys did learn something from this quick little easy tutorial or install it is very 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 beginner friendly the fact that i didn't pluck the closure at all even for my baby hairs i really didn't do it for all the beginners that may be watching so i can show you that you can still get this nice little look without having to do work that you don't know how to do like plucking or something like that so i didn't do anything to this closure nothing at all except for bleach it bleach the knots that's literally all i did and i cut the lace off and that's it even like right here i kind of like over bleached it a little but you can't tell you can't even tell that so that is pretty much it for this video you guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to give it a big thumbs up comment down something below and subscribe if you are not subscribed already i love you guys so much and i will see you all in my next video Mwah.